And let's go ahead and go full screen. So this one is gonna be for the viewers at home. I'm gonna go over the team. So we're running a Giratina Origin with Will-O-Wisp, Shadow Ball, Draco Meteor, and Protect. Enough speed, we're at plus two. We're gonna outspeed Regieleki. And that's uh, that's relevant because we have a Suicune on the team. We have a White Herb Groudon with a lot of special defense. It's just the set that I run on everything. We have my bulky GMX Venusaur. Safety Goggles, Standard Incineroar. We have the bulky Bronzong for the possible Calyrex Ice matchup. And we have a super defensive Suicune that can take a Life Orb, Timid, uh, Thunderbolt from Regieleki. So yeah, let's see what we can do. Dude, I'm hoping I do well, Iron Will. This is gonna be... <laughs> This is gonna be a rough one. I can guarantee you that. What are we at on the Silky Baritone ult? 13, uh, 13. 13. So that, that's that's not bad. We're at like a decent rating. As I would say, this isn't a terrible matchup for us, especially for Giratina. It's it's not that bad. Or actually, the the um <laughs> the uh what is it called? Kingdra could be kind of annoying. So what I think I want to do here is I should be able to always go like Groudon Suicune here. Bring the Giratina in the back, and I think my last Mon might end up being the... I mean, Bronzong isn't bad, considering how slow our team is. Like, the speed tier that we hit. But I could also get quite a bit of value off of the Venusaur lead. Which I might do. Uh, I'm mostly just concerned about the... I'm mostly just concerned about the um, Landorus, so I am going to go Incineroar. Because I think they want to lead Lando. Alright, they do go Kingdra and Cinnaror, which isn't great for me. Um, but I should be able to go for a Snarl here pretty much for free as they go for a Max Geyser on my Groudon. So I'm going to go ahead and go into Giratina and Snarl up. Yep. You tank that. Oh, that was a crit too. Yikes. Snarl. I can Tailwind now. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and Protect here. Try to live the hit. There's the Max Airstream. That's not ideal. Not ideal at all. Scald on Zacian will do quite a bit of damage, but I think I'd rather just let him take the Giratina away from me. Because I shouldn't drop to any combination of hits, and if I can keep Groudon alive, that'd be great. I'll try to Scald this guy. Yeah, I should take the combo of hits. Nice, and I get the Will-O-Wisp off. I hope. Awesome, that's great. That's actually great for me. Zacian's no longer an issue. Uh, so what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna go into my... I wanna Snarl again. This is a little bit risky. I think what I can do here is just let them take the Giratina. And I'm going to try to Draco Meteor the Kingdra. And I suppose I can go with the Scalder here. Yeah. That's fine. Uh, I just do like the same thing. Zacian goes down soon, which is going to be amazing for me. I can Protect now, I suppose. And I'm going to go for a Snarl. Alright, so now what I do is I'm going to go into my Groudon, and I should be able to always go Incineroar here, and I'm going to click the Max Quake on the Kingdra. Because yeah, because I will be able to get this off, and I should take the hit okay, and now I have Fake Out versus Kyogre. Ooh, that actually did a lot more than I'm comfortable with. So that'll KO. And I'm going to get two special defense boosts on my Incineroar. Uh, it's actually a little bit... <laughs> it's a little bit iffy now. Go for a Fake Out. Go for a Max Quake. I think I'm faster. I have a decent amount of speed on my guy, you know? Oh, he's going to give me the Zacian. Yo, that's actually hype. Because I can get my Groudon off the field now. Is that... It, I don't know if that's worth it, actually. Is that worth it? Um, 
I suppose here I can attempt to snarl. And... Because he's going to be faster, right? I mean, maybe I take it. I think I end up doing better with the sun on the field in terms of survivability if I get the snarl off. So I'm going to end my Dynamax. Especially since I'm at minus, like, three. All right. Incineroar lives, which is great. And now I think it's going to be really close. It, it, like, it depends if, if I'm faster or not. I think it's my best bet just to go for the Snarl on the Protect. Even though, like, Incineroar probably just dies here. Yeah. Okay, I need a crit. No, I just go down. All right, GG. So, not too good on the first game. I think this team can work, though. I think it's it's just like a real rough... <laughs> just a real rough team in general. Um, So, it's probably just going to be Bulldoze, Calyrex, plus the... Very, very annoying um, Solgaleo matchup. Good old base 90 speed wars. Exactly, exactly. Here's what I think I do. I'm going to lead off Giratina Origin. And I'm going to go Suicune. I'm going to bring my Grout on the back. And I think my last Mon, I can get away with the Incineroar pretty safely. That's pretty much what I expected. I'm going to go for the Protect here. Oh, wait. I don't take the combo of moves. That is something I forgot about. Uh, <laughs> I kind of have to go for the Tailwind. All right, he's going to Dynamax, so I'm just going to die. Yeah, Life Orb. Not Life Orb, okay. Okay, this isn't terrible. Because I just go Incineroar here. And I always prioritize the Calyrex. They don't have any Flying types, so... White Herb's going to be really clutch there. Calyrex doesn't quite go down, but I can just... I should just be able to go for the Snarl to KO and uh, Max Quake on the Regieleki. Yeah. It's probably Fake Tears in the Whimsicott. Which means I'm safe here if I just go for a Protect into a Snarl. Oh, Galio. Okay. Um, I'm really not concerned with that. Just gonna double it. Switcheroo. Okay, Eject Button. That's fine, because I'm still gonna get a really strong Flare Blitz off here. Burn. Oh, no, we just one shot. Okay. Okay. Um, we lose. Because he's just going to fake tears me. I'm, I'm pretty certain he's just going to fake tears me. I mean, I don't drop to a regular one. Um, he's not life orb, though. Yeah, he's not life orb. So I suppose there's no reason to protect here in case he doesn't fake tears. No, I just lose. Oh, wait, did I win? No, all right. Dazzling Gleam Whimsicott. Okay, I was like, how did that happen? <laughs> This team sucks. I'm going to be honest. This seems, this seems pretty bad. Hey, thank you, Philip. I don't know if I'd get much out of Shadow Sneak, to be honest. I would have to, like, change my name. If I want to one-shot the Calyrex with Shadow Sneak, it's, it probably, I probably don't anyways. And I would have to change my nature to be, like, a minus defense or special defense. Okay. I don't think I like Giratina plus Groudon. I think it might be really bad. Um, I mean, I should be able to lead off with uh, Groudon Suicune here again. Bring the Venusaur in the back, and I think, or the Incineroar in the back, and I think I can try Giratina. Okay. So here's the issue. Who are they gonna one shot? <laughs> that's that's the question here. Who do they who do they attempt to one shot? One would assume it'd be the Groudon. 
I can try to go Incineroar and Snarl. Giratina is not a fire pick. Giratina is garbage. And okay, I got the call right. So now, now what I can do is go for the parting shot on the Venusaur, and I'm going to get in my Giratina here. To eat the hit. Is he Thunder Waves? That's the worst part about facing Grim Snarls, the Thunder Waves. Okay. And now I suppose I can Tailwind. And I don't want to Dynamax this thing because it's just so risky. I think I definitely do better Dynamaxing my uh Dynamaxing my Grout on here. I'm gonna go for Shadow Ball damage. Alright. I should live that. And the Vine Lash damage will send me into berry range as I get fully paralyzed. That's not amazing. Uh I mean I can try this. Yeah, no. I if I switch if I switch Giratina to Eveltal, the team becomes infinitely better. I survive. Come on. Ah, Giratina, you're so useless, dude. You're actually the worst. <laughs> okay. Uh let's try this. Let's try this. I'm gonna I'm gonna try to sword stance. Oh, that's not gonna work. All right, maybe we'll get lucky here. This this is such a bad restricted. Okay, Grim Snarl is gonna drop. I hope. Is he miss a dude? We're getting so lucky on this one. Our opponent's actually gonna be mad. There's the ogre. I'm gonna tailwind up and I'm gonna go for a quake. I live all of these hits. And now they just lose. Now they just lose because the Kyogre is within scald range, I would assume. And I can quake the Venusaur. All right, and yeah, we have two turns to tail once so we win. I literally just scald uh, P blades, and that'll do it. Like, yeah, I can miss like that, but yeah, no, I get the scald burn. P blades again. All right, we're gonna try to redeem this. How can I change? I honestly, I, I think that's about as good as Giratina gets. I can put a Whimsicott on the team. And, you know, make it worse against Calyrex and Kiram, but <laughs> maybe I just need to change the way I'm looking at the team. Maybe I need to, like, get more just brain-dead offense on my opponent. Like here, uh, I'm going to go Giratina and I'm going to go Suicune. And I'm bringing the Grout on the back and the Incineroar. Because I haven't Dynamaxed my Giratina yet. I have yet to Dynamax the Giratina. Hopefully my opponent picks his move soon. Okay, this is this is doable. It's it's obviously not ideal because my opponent can just do his thing versus me. But I think what I can do here is, uh, actually no, this is awful because I'm just gonna get max lightning. I can attempt this. I can attempt to go grout on in, in tailwind, but I'm probably just gonna get max lightning in one shot. The eerie impulse. Yo, that's that's actually fire for me. Actually, if they parting shot, I'm I'm in trouble. Yeah, no. Uh, the white herb is now gone. <laughs> the magic is dead. Groudon is, Groudon is no more. Alright, I'm gonna Snarl here. I was thinking, like, if they parting shot, I still keep my, you know, my attack stat, which isn't, the, it's not the worst, you know. Uh, but now, I, I definitely don't. <laughs> Alright, 
Thunderbolt, I survived that. Don't ice beam. Water spout, okay, check this out. This Zapdos is not going to get the upper hand on me. It is, it is not. Uh, my strongest move is Max Wormwind, but I get more out of Max Phantasm, but I'm very concerned this might not KO the Zapdos. I'm gonna helping hand. Okay, Incineroar is no more. He's lost his Incineroar privileges. Please drop. It doesn't. This this Pokemon sucks. This Pokemon's the worst. Luckily, I should be able to just max... Oh, not max. Phantasm. Max Wormwind it again. And go hard into my... Actually, maybe I just go for the Scald on the Zacian. I think I get more out of Incineroar. Because I just nerfed this thing into ground. Cessation does no types of damage this turn. And I still have a turn to do stuff. There's the Zapdos. Okay, Zapdos is priority number one. Here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to assume the Zapdos is about to Eerie Impulse me. So what I want to do is try to KO it. I'm going to Max Wormwind and I'm going to Fake Out. If he Dynamaxes, so be it. Life Orb Eerie Impulse is kind of... That's, that's kind of the truth, to be honest. Hi, Ogre. Okay. Be gone. Oh, we get paralyzed. That sucks. Be gone. That thing actually drops. That's great. And there's no more rain unless he Dynamaxes. So there, there's actually a lot that's nice here. Okay. I'm going to Protect, and I'm going to go into my Suicune... My Suicune. This is a very scary endgame. E-Blade. Geyser. I survive. That's awesome. Geyser does like almost nothing to me. Here is my very sussy Wincon. Groudon. Snarl. <laughs> I th actually, if I Tailwind, I'm in a really good spot. I'm going to try to survive this turn by doing this, because I think he wants to go ahead and try to one-shot my Giratina. Or actually, maybe I go Incineroar here and Snarl. That's actually probably an easier chance to live. Because I need to make sure I Intimidate that once. Okay, I think we did it. Oh, Suicune so dies. Okay. That's fine. Because now we have Fake Out Pressure. So what I can do is I can go... Alright, I have an idea. How do I... I need to cycle Incineroar in one more time while also getting Groudon in after this last Max Geyser. So I think what I do is I go Giratina. And I hard switch... No, because that's just a target for Max Geyser. I go Groudon. Because that's my best chance for living this. And I'm gonna double out and try to parting shot this um, this Kyogre. It's probably my best shot. Live, live. Oh, he doubled it. That's fine. Um, this is still winnable. Zacian's at neutral, and Groudon's on the field. Here's how I do this. I'm gonna P Blades. And I'm also going to... I should be faster than this Kyogre, so it might not be a waste of time to Draco Meteor it. But I think P-Blades into Shadow Ball just KOs it. I'm going to double it. Because I think he protects the Zacian here. Yep. That did decent damage. Ice Beam, come on. P-Blades, KO? Uh, not quite, not quite. Okay. I should be able to win with a P-Blades if this works out. Um, let me think. So, Behemoth Blade should KO me from this range, I think. I'm at 51%. Ice Beam does quite a bit, though. I think I just go for it. Because if he doubles me, I lose. I, maybe I protect and I just Shadow Ball. But if he... If he, he has to double. 
Uh, no, he got it right. Okay, I could have just behemoth. Or I could have just P-Blade to win. Dang it, man. Dang it. All right, maybe he misses. All right, that sucked. <laughs> I was hoping to get like a highlight video out of this out of this team like hey man it turns out Giratina Origin isn't that bad but guys I think this 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 is the contender for like top 5 worst this is a contender for top 5 worst restricteds We haven't won a single game tonight I think we won one Yeah we won one game tonight Okay Giratina on lead isn't the worst. Unless they leave off Eveltal, in which case it's absolutely the worst, because Eveltal eats my team for breakfast. Not real Giratina hours, true. Listen, if Giratina could hold a life orb, it would be okay. If it could keep these stats and hold a life orb, it would actually be pretty okay. But it doesn't. It also needs like Hurricane or something. Oh no, we got recognized on the bad account. <laughs> or on, uh, with the bad team on the alt account. Dude, Giratina would still be kind of bad with Astro Barrage. If it had to hold Griskius Orb, it would still be kind of bad with Astro Barrage. Okay, yeah, that's like the exact lead I didn't want to see. So I'm going to go Incineroar here and Snarl. I want to say they just Dynamax the Eveltal and try to go for like Shadow Ball KOs with a special defense drop. But, you know, the Eveltal's slower, one would assume. Okay. That worked. Uh, let me see. I mean, I'm just gonna double Snarl, to be honest. Like, what's what's the downside of this? Let me get Tailwind as well. Obviously, they could go Solgaleo, which I wouldn't appreciate. Oh, yo, hold on, check this out. Gamer move. They think they're slick. They think they're going to get a weakness policy boost. They are. Oh, it's an incinerator. That's not great. Okay. I get a Scald off, which is kind of cool. I'm going to go Giratina and try to Scald. This might not work, uh, but I really doubt he Shadow Balls Incineroar. Man, oh, why is it so bad? Like, <laughs> why is it actually so bad? Okay. Ah, eh. <laughs> that was just a certified eh moment. Um, all right, so here's the thing. They should never stay in and let me take the, the Spectre from them. I should be able to keep this guy by going for... There's a Scald KO. It lost 42% last time. I'm going to max Wormwind and Snarl. Because I keep my guy now. And I can prevent like weakness policy boosting the, the guy. Yeah, nice. And I still have a turn to, to work with, so I can just take the Spectre from them. Did the ladder reset on Showdown? It shouldn't. Yeah, I know, I'm gonna get Snarled right now. But you know it's even cooler than, than, you know, getting Snarled? Snarling it. Boom. I mean, they don't have a switch into this, like Spectre probably just goes down. It might survive behind a Protect, but this is actually a pretty strong attack. All right, nice. Yeah, I don't mind losing Giratina here if it means I get a defense drop on Eveltal. And a minus one. Augers.
Okay, I'm about to do the most gamery gamer move of all time. Check this out. Max Guard, Tailwind. He's going to Sucker Punch my Eveltal, or my Giratina. But here's what I'm going to do. Next turn, I'm going to burn the Solgaleo, and then I'm going to get the win. And then everyone's going to be like, Argos, you're so smart. Woo. <laughs> I hope. Okay. Check it. Boom. Survive it. Bam. Bop. Scald as well in case I miss. <laughs> Come on. Giratina land the will o wisp. This will make it all worth it. This will this will mean I can actually get a video out of this. This awful team. It all comes down to this. Sucker Punch fails. will o -Wisp lands. The crowd goes wild. Marcos has won. Alright, and now I send in my Incineroar. And, uh... I'm gonna... I'm gonna scald this, this thing for damage. Because I don't want a weakness policy yet, obviously. Is that the space slug? Yes, unfortunately we're using Giratina today. <laughs> Wisp Skull double is honestly a mood. Yeah, man, I didn't want to miss. <laughs> I was so uncertain about that actually landing that I was like, yeah, I'm just gonna double it. Sucker Punch fails. Scald goes off. A second burn. No? Okay. Max Rockfall on the Suicune. Wasted opportunity. Behold, Groudon enters the field. <laughs> I'm so stupid, guys. Uh, I should be able to go for this parting shot rock slide play. Or actually, I think I just flare blitz rock slide to get rid of the Eveltal, and then I should be able to win. This foul play shouldn't really do too much to Groudon. I don't have that much attack investment. Rock slide and flare blitz should pick it up now. Boom. Flare blitz, swords dance, dab. This one game made this whole ordeal worth it. This Pokemon's garbage. Okay, guys. Time to uh, time to wrap up this awful experiment. I'm going to say this right now. Giratina is possibly the worst idea I have ever had. Um, yes, I, I, I used Necrozma before, but that was because you guys voted for it. This was of my own doing. I said, Giratina might not be that bad. And no, it was. This is the worst thing I've ever used. Dynamaxed or not, it fails to pick up KOs. It has to hold this awful item and it has a losing matchup versus like three of the five most used restricteds. It only does good versus Solgaleo sometimes and Groudon like 100% of the time. It's it's only good versus Groudon. It's an anti-Groudon pick. If I could change anything about the team, I would make this thing a, an Eveltal. And then all of a sudden the team gets better. So yeah, that's, that's the conclusion. <laughs> Thank you all for coming out tonight.